on this date in history, the 16th day of December. There are only a few moments in history that I would have really liked to have been a part of. And this is one of them, the Boston Tea Party, Sam Adams, the Sons of Liberty, disguising themselves as Mohicans. <laughs> and uh, they uh, went onto a British ship and dumped a bunch of tea because of a three cent tea tax. And it was part of that uh, first rebellion scenario that led to the American Revolution. They actually paid off that tea bill, by the way, the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, in 1961. It was 196 bucks worth of tea <laughs> paid to the crown. 1949, manufacturer that would become the maker of Saab began making automobiles. They were already in the jet business, so that's what they took, jet engineering, and put it on the ground. 1913, Charles Chaplin made his debut. He started working for Keystone Studios. Yeah, of the Capes. And uh, his meteoric rise to the top began, the little tramp. And Colonel Harlan Sanders died on this date in history, 1980. I used to have the coolest photo of the Colonel in my wallet that he signed with every best wish, the Colonel, to Randy. And I, it's tearful, I lost her. I think I went swimming with it in my wallet once, I don't know. Uh, anyway, he once said, if you feed the poor, you'll get rich. If you feed the rich, you'll get poor. <clears throat> Ludwig van Beethoven, spell that, back, spell Colonel for me, and then Beethoven. <sighs> Ludwig van Beethoven, born on this date, 1770. Bum, 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 I am born. <laughs> Uh, Jane Austen, 1775, was born. Noel Coward, great writer, 1899. And Margaret Mead, anthropologist, 1901. She once said, women are always drawn to mediocre men, and men are doing anything they can to become mediocre. <clears throat> well, they're working hard at something. It's National Chocolate Covered Anything Day. Oh, one of my favorite days. I like chocolate-covered nipples, I mean almonds. Oh, they're the best. Try that.